What's up, soldiers? Your boy Chris here, Caribbean Pot.com. I'm setting up in the kitchen as usual. It is Sunday afternoon. Just got back in from the grocery store. You probably see those bags and stuff back there. I hate packing groceries. I think I hate it more than uh, unpacking the dishwasher. Anyways, we're doing a spiced chicken drumsticks in the oven. You're gonna like this one, man. So much similar to jerk chicken with some minor differences. You're gonna like this one. Vibes it up. First thing we've got to do, and I have a whole bunch of all the spices I'll be using over there. We'll get to that in a second, but I want to get some orange zest into the bowl. We're making <clears throat> a marinade that we're going to marinate the chicken with first. I just want a, a little bit of this orange zest. The oils from this will, as well as that lovely citrus scent, will work great <clears throat> in this. <laughs> get it great, I'm grating. <laughs> Play on words. Anyways, you need some oranges. If you don't have oranges, you can use lemon or lime. I much prefer orange. Just gonna scrape that in there. We're gonna go in with some fresh ground black pepper. Sea salt. You can use whatever salt you got. And a good dose of olive oil. Olive oil is the only liquid I'll be using to bring everything together. So a couple tablespoons of that. And over here, I'm using all dried ingredients. For instance, this is dried green onions and dried thyme. If you have fresh, feel free to use fresh. I totally get it if you want to use fresh. But for me, in the middle of winter, I'm going with dried. We've got some brown sugar, some allspice, some nutmeg, some cinnamon, garlic powder, onion powder, uh, ginger. If I missed anything here, everything will be listed down in the description of the video and when I post it on CaribbeanPod.com. So all we're going to do now is put everything into our bowl here and give it a good mix. And if you find it's a little bit too dry, you can always add a little bit more of that olive oil if you want. This is exactly where I want it to be. I need it dry because I'm not trying to, to make this too soggy. And unlike the other sort of spicy sort of jerk recipes we've shared in the past, this one I'm doing on a rack in the oven so it won't be sitting in moisture. This is why I want it really dry. Here I have the chicken drumsticks all prepped and ready to go. Move over camera, what you doing? All I'm going to do, put that in there, and now it's just a matter of going in there with my hands. Roll up the sleeves, Chris, and all you want to do is give it a good rub. If you want to wear gloves for this, that's cool because we've got those pepper flakes and everything in there, so if you're a little bit sensitive with your skin there you may want to wear gloves but anyways that is all you would do give it a good massage and let that marinate for about three or four hours in the fridge all i did here was i put the, i sprayed my wire rack here with some uh some cooking spray you can brush some vegetable oil on there if you don't have cooking spray and i just laid out the drumsticks on top of it i have a sheet pan on the bottom to catch any sort of drippings i don't want to make a mess in that oven oven has been preheated to 400 degrees fahrenheit so 400 degrees fahrenheit this is going to go on the middle rack now and you notice there's some space between each of the drumsticks there. I want that air to be able to circulate. And this is why I said earlier, I want this to be relatively dry. That's why you only use uh, a bit of um, olive oil. In the oven, 400 degrees Fahrenheit, middle rack. So there you go, friends. Chris here, CaribbeanPod.com. It took just over an hour, so about an hour and 10 minutes. Middle rack, 400 degrees Fahrenheit, and these are all done. One, a couple things I forgot to mention. You can add a bit more salt if you wanted to. Um, again, the ingredients will be listed down in the description below. Um, the second thing is I use chicken with the skin on. You can totally go skinless if you want. Works great with chicken thighs as well, as well as chicken wings. Always a pleasure to have you guys here in the kitchen with me. Get a nice little something going on here, boy. 
I have a Greek salad. Gonna enjoy this Sunday afternoon. Bless up and thanks a lot. Hey, hit that video that thumbs up now, man. I know all this Skylocking. Please hit that thumbs up. Vibes it up.